I mean, she got the broken marriage, she got the predation of the creepy co-anchor, and then she suffers through a biblical plague on live TV to become the one human that people can actually relate to in this show of a so-called democracy. I did not discover Alex, but I did bring her back from the dead. So, to your question, Alex Levy is Lazarus, and that makes me Jesus. 400 million years, that's how long they've been here. I don't know. There were sharks in that ocean before there were rings around Saturn. Humans, we're just a blip. Showed up yesterday, almost certainly be gone tomorrow. All we have is today, my money is on them. Close, 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 like your life depends on it. You're a primordial man on the savanna. It's hot. That antelope is faster, but you are uh, ravenous. And you can smell it. The antelope is getting tired. And you got a rock in your hand. All that's left to do is bludgeon that poor beast to death. So I don't want to hear any more about preferred stock or dead assumption. I want death in the afternoon. You never cease to surprise me, Alex. You are on the verge of getting everything you ever wanted out of this place. Power in your own right. And you choose instead to be the girlfriend, the plus one. And that's not me talking. That is sadly the uh, patriarchal cesspool that we live in. But now I can promise you every decision you make at UBA, it'll be pulled apart and scrutinized by the public. Not to mention everybody in this building. More stuff is going to come out about me. And it is going to make me look like a monster. Some of it will be true. Some of it won't be, doesn't matter. He's going to try to bury me. <laughs> Maybe I should have listened to you. Maybe I deserve it. Maybe I lost myself in chasing all of this. Anyway, I just wanted you to hear it from me. Don't flinch. It's what you always taught me, right? 